my inexperience. I think it's in bad shape. Nothing doesn't look too good to me. So I don't know if that's the first uh, sign. House looks a little neglected. Um, but let's go take a look inside. Okay, Jody, this is the entranceway. There's real hardwood floors. Walk in, there's a little step down. Maybe a, I would say a little formal living area. And this would be the formal dining room. When we walk into the left, this is, could be considered a bedroom, but most likely an office. There is surround sound speakers, seems like in all the rooms. They got nice glass doors. Um, we'll go to the left. And here is the master. Pretty nice size. And it's partitioned off. There's a little step down here. Maybe another sitting area. Sliders to the outside. I see some lifting here. Pretty substantial on the hardwood. I don't know what that is, but I will investigate. Oh, this is weird. There's plumbing out here in this little step down area. I don't know what that would be for. And here's the master bath. Nice big closet. I mean, the bathrooms are just as nice as in the pictures. The mirrors are okay. Shutters, beautiful. Cabinets are a dark oak. Nothing special, but I think you could do a lot with them. Nice big jetted tub. Shower. I think there's some AC problems. There's a note saying they are going to fix it. Go to the right. Some closets. Here's a bedroom, hmm. big bedroom, closet shutters. This is right in the front of the house. And here's, this bedroom has its own bath. Pretty wild. Tile. And then across the way is the other bath, which we've seen. with the white mirrors. A uh, big laundry room with a sink. And another bedroom here. So, so far we've seen three plus the office. No closet doors. Cute little window bench. Look at that. That's cute. speakers again in these rooms. And that's it for here downstairs. So this is the family room, fireplace. You have those stairs. The floor is beautiful, the wood floor. Oh, they have one of these weird built-ins, which is always hard to put a TV in, especially with the, the style TVs today, but that could always come out. And here's the kitchen. Wow. So, big island here, sitting area. Actually, not the island, it'd just be a, 
a bar, breakfast bar. These are nice cabinets. These look upgraded. Yes, these are very nice cabinets in the kitchen. Three sinks, one prep sink. Nice appliances. I don't know what was in here. I'm going to guess a trash compactor. And a um, convection gen air stove top. And your double ovens. And a sub-zero fridge. So kitchen's very nice. I have to say one thing that's weird. I'm kind of rubbing my feet over the uh, hardwood floor and my sneakers are getting caught. It's like parts are very subtly lifted. I mean, maybe that's just what happens with hardwood floors out here. They probably did a glue down, which is the easiest way to do it out here. I mean, it's beautiful, and I don't know if maybe just a little sanding might level that out. And some other floor issues here. It almost looks like they tried to fill this in with grout. I don't know if they had scratched up the floor. This is right between the refrigerator and the island. It does look like grout. Yeah, I think that they tried to cover it up because there was a gouge taken out of the floor. Okay, now we're going up this winding staircase. A little precarious. And there's a loft up here. This is the view over the kitchen. The wood beams are really nice. That's some cruddy fluorescent lights, but that can be changed. So it's three bedrooms, an office, and the loft. Because the homes are vacant for a while. Um, so here's the backyard. Very private. Got a fire pit. Lots of grass, definitely lots of room for a pool. Then they have a, well, some kind of water feature which is now green and grody. And, you know, no HOA here, so you can see people have an RV. It's the back of the house. Huge palm trees. I mean, definitely a lot of potential in the yard. I am concerned about the roof. Um, I didn't see any evidence of any moisture. And it's consistently odd, so maybe it's supposed to be that way. Go take a look over here. Fruit tree, side yard, another AC there. They have no seller's disclosure on this home. I'm going to call the agent again and see what the story is. But totally private. Nobody could see in your backyard. So here it is from the driveway. Old garage doors. Just the old wooden ones. So lots of parking. Now it's in a little older neighborhood. I'm sure there are homes that's, you know, over time will need some updating. Hi. Hi. 